joining us for the next installment in our Spotlight video series. For this um, video, we're going to have a little closer look at one of the, uh, what I think is one of the rock star pieces of furniture in the collection, and it's this sideboard. It's original to the house, so it was here when the family moved in in 1865. We believe it was built by the local um, Providence uh, furniture firm of Anthony Potter and Dennison. So it was custom made for the, the, the house here, made in Providence for this Providence house. But I think it's really interesting because it's very current and exactly what you'd expect to see in a high style Victorian dining room like the Lippitt family had. You can see here there's a lot of really kind of fun intricate carving that really kind of goes to this hunt and harvest theme that you'll see throughout the dining room space. Um, there's a fox on one side and a hound and it looks like they are kind of like in mid chase and then up at the very top of the piece is a stag head up at the, at the uh, pediment. And so all these images kind of really kind of echo what a masculine space the dining room was. It was a place for Henry Lippitt to really demonstrate his ability as a father and as a husband to provide for his family. And that really kind of echoes back to these great English or Scottish country houses where you'd have stag's heads um, displayed in you know, very formal banquet halls. And so by having a stag head here on, on top of this very elaborate on the sideboard, it kind of echoes back into this. So this is really a rock star piece. It's even you know published in a very well re respected um, uh, um, book about Victorian design and influences and how that really relates to social constructs of the time. So this is a really fun piece that our visitors um, really enjoy seeing. And I uh, look forward to uh, seeing you here and that you can see the, the piece in person. Thank you very much. Take care.